Hey guys, I'll be introducing to you another version of the Muslim Odin 2 version 2.0. So sometime back, three weeks back, I installed one tool which was uh, the same version of Muslim Odin 2, but it was version 1.0. So now there is the latest version which has been updated. So guys, I'll be showing you how to use it. So this is the one which I'm talking about, the Muslim Odin tool, version 2.0. This one is a small Windows tool. Uh, the Muslim Odin tool is released by Ali Hussein and Volp also by him. So this tool is available in portable mode. Use the tool without installation process. This tool allows users to unlock Samsung Mobile FRP one click, only by one click. Muslim Odin tool includes a FRP file, PIT file, ADB, and it can also enable the ADB file. So all these guys will be summarizing them in this small short tutorial or video. So guys, just follow along as I'll be extracting the files. As I had told you, it's a small tool, guys, which doesn't take all that, uh, a lot of space, as in also a lot of data. So here we go, guys. I'll open up the folder. So this is the setup of the Muslim Modin version 2.0 by Ali Hussein. So all credits go to Ali Hussein for sharing us with this tool so that it can be of beneficial to us in our uh, mobile repair and uh, related software issues with mobile phones guys i'll go ahead to install it as you can see so meanwhile as we wait for it to load up guys as it's loading so this is the tool, uh, nothing has changed much on the interface, it is the same tool like before, only that there are new features and more models which have been added so that it can be easy for you to use it. As you can, as you can see here, uh, it's updated already, Muslim Modin version 2.0 by Al Hussein. So guys here is where you select uh, the model of your phone. A particular mode of your phone uh, come some sound phones and others uh, yes yeah, where you check them up here you can go ahead to select the model of your choice which you want to work on and also if you want to use the pd file uh, this is the same uh, corner where i click then you select the model by clicking on the certain model then you can go ahead to download that file and uh, if you're having your internet connection already so if you want to do other things like uh, like uh, reading info mtp you just click on this one you connect your phone as long as uh, your battery is full on the phone and uh, the, uh, the screen is on then you can go ahead to tackle it out so if you want to re reset the frp by ADB mode, still the same thing. So the interface is quite easy and uh, it's somehow not all that tricky or difficult to use. It is user friendly. So, guys, I have nothing much I can explain more, only that just in case you have any issue with it, like uh, if you feel like leaving any comment, you can leave it in the comment section down below. Then I'll just go ahead to answer you just in case. So other things uh, you can also, it can help you here as in uh, driver installation process, but you have to be connected on the internet. So it will install those drivers and uh, this works perfect with the internet connection. Guys, so this is it all about uh, the updated tool. I just wanted to show you how it is. So as you can see here, if I continue with next, I'll be installing the drivers and others. So for other mobile phones, I'll just cancel the installation because I don't need it, guys. 
so for other mobile phones uh, you just click here so when you click here on all mobile FRP so for example they are telling you here before entering here the phone must be unconnected to the computer uh, your mobile phone shouldn't be attached to the PC either with the USB cable or you've connected it in any other way like Bluetooth and others but it has to be disconnected from the PC then now uh, second you have to connect your phone before you start you must connect your phone to Wi-Fi so your phone must be also connected on the running internet connection that's Wi-Fi if you don't have like Wi-Fi you can make a hotspot using another phone and go ahead to connect it so you'll just go ahead to click on start and wait so this is where you click yeah depending on uh, the particular phone uh, which you are going to work on uh, which you want to remove the FRP lock either Samsung or Huawei either Samsung, Huawei, LG, ITEL, OnePlus, Plus Zomi, Infinity, any phone, all models are supported here guys. This is the great feature which uh, which has been in, added in this tool. So as you can see here, so when it, you have no drivers here, you can also go ahead to repair your drivers, then it will get you the particular drivers. So as long as you do, uh, you follow these steps, then you just click on uh, start FRP browser MTP. So here it will just launch a YouTube or it will open a Samsung page for you guys. Then you know how to follow along that process. So this is the brief summary of everything. So it will be showing you everything step by step like that. So all these are here you can uh, you can check them out and you see them then this one is for mtp uh, factory set if you want to do a factory set so you guys if you uh, have some sun and you want to maybe to root it as long as you have the root file you can just click here and load that root file then you'll go ahead to flash it uh, and your phone will be rooted thank you guys for watching i just want to keep this tutorial brief and precise so that I don't take more of your time guys thank you for watching kindly do subscribe to our channel so that you be encouraging us to upload more content which is more helpful to you guys in your mobile repair and other related software issues both PC and mobile phones guys thank you for watching bye